Um, y'all forgot to tell y'all when I do use my Cenafil uh products, I do wipe. I dry my um, face off with napkins, clean napkins, and throw them away. I don't dry my face off with no face rag, with no new face rag. I always get a clean paper towel and, you know, just dab my face until it's uh, dry because it's sanitary. But um, to clean it with, like, a clean paper towel, it's not like you finna reuse the paper towels. And it's not like paper towels are a lot, you know, just buy your roll of paper towels and... Every time you wash your face with whatever product that you like to use, clean your face off with a paper towel and I guarantee you the difference that you're going to see using a towel versus then using a napkin that is clean, that has not ever been used, that don't have no type of chemical product. Yeah, you'll see a difference. You'll see a difference in your skin, how clear it's going to get. Yeah, so I'm just going to keep it on this mannequin or whatever uh, so y'all can look at it better. Yes, your girl. So it is down. And this is what I sold it on to a canvas. Um, so yes. Uh this is the Eunice hair inches 28. I think I got like two 28s, 226, and a 20 inch closure, all Brazilian straight. And um y'all, this hair is just I don't know it's so the one word to describe this hair is annoying because it sheds and i don't know if it's because i just have a big if i have a bad batch because i like you need to say i like i love that curly hair like that's what i started off getting and um i got some more of their curly hair but it was like a, a looser wave and then i wanted to try their straight hair because their hair was just so bomb <sighs> But now, since I got a straight hair, it's like, what is going on? It sheds like crazy. It sheds like crazy. Now, I know, I know I could, um, you know, uh, could have washed this for y'all because it's like maybe like a week old hair. But this is just being realistic with y'all. I'm not even trying to bash them like that. I'm not saying go out and don't get no more hair for now. I'm just saying be aware and do your research and look at more views. Um, even after washing the hair, because you see it's a little oily. And I hate that about this hair as well, that it just draws to oil so bad. And I guess because I, you know, I moisturize and seal my hair every other day underneath my wigs. That's why I love wigs. That it kind of like capture, it kind of obtain that oil. But, yeah, that's oil that y'all see. Yeah, this is not no lust. This is not the lust of the hair. <laughs> this is oil. Um, so yeah. That's how it looks. That's how it looks. That's the ends. And y'all can see that it's just shedding its life away. Just every strand is sh shedding off. One thing I will say about this hair, uh, a pro about it is that um, the closure, I think I've had this hair for like three months. This closure is not balding at all, as y'all can see. I didn't use my little technique with the eyeshadow. This is the part that was in it when I first showed you guys this hair. <clears throat> so it's not balding at all. So that's what I really love. Um, not really love, but you know, something I like about this hair. Uh, so yeah, I thought that the straight hair would be, you know, more low maintenance than the curly hair. Not trying to throw shots or nothing like that. But you know, I just thought it would be less maintenance on this hair but it's actually not i feel like i have to wash this hair maybe every two three days because you see how it looks how that oil just building up and the hair is just getting all stuck together yeah that's that's just how i feel so i'm just taking a break from it and wearing my curly hair and um i want to do a separate video on this hair because this hair i really want to talk about this is the hair that i actually want to sell so stay tuned for that video but back to this wig though y'all um it's just annoying uh it doesn't sh tangle it doesn't tangle we don't go we don't have them problems over here it just sheds it just sheds and i guess you know you can cut that off by putting by using shed glue um I think it's called, I think it's called Shed Glue, Shed Wheel, something like that. You put it, I know what it is though, I just can't think of the name right now, but before you sew your tracks in, you want to lay your tracks out and it's just some type of product that you put on the wheels of your, well, you put on the tracks and it's just supposed to 
steal your wealth. And I think that's what it's called, um, wealth stealer or steal wealth uh, glue. And it just helps the helps with the shedding. I did not cut this hair up. This hair is been folded. Uh, so I'm not sure what really the problem is. I can really just think of that it's just shedding because it sheds. Um, that's really all the problems that I go through with this hair that it shed. It don't tangle. It don't bleed when I wash it. It doesn't smell, never smell. The closure's not going bald. It just sheds. It just sheds. And I don't like how it just, you know, the oil just... Like when I'm wearing, like even this part right here, like it, like this part hits my face, and you know I moisturize my face all the time or whatever. Um, this this area in the front always get oily, like heavy oil on it. Like what is going on? Y'all see this too? Like it's even rubbing off on my hand. Like y'all see that? This part right here that touched my face, it always pick up the oils off my face, like pushing it back or whatever. <laughs> like trying to do something real quick. To, avoid their look but um yes y'all this is tiffany she's taking a break once you know when i decide to wear her again or i sell it whatever i do i'm gonna you know wash it <clears throat> air dry it and then press it out whatever i decide to do with it i might just put it back in whenever i feel like i'm wearing my long hair add more hair to it like i've been doing like i'm letting you guys know now like that is something that I always done. I don't cut my long bundles and I be telling my friend that too. Um my friends that don't cut your long bundles. Just add to it. If you want some short hair, go get some short hair. Like longer hair is more expensive than shorter hair. So why would you cut your longer hair? Why not add to it? I put heat on it. It's just going shorter and shorter. Y'all not gonna lie, this was a 28 and it's still a 28. Like after like three months, it's a 28. I'm thinking about adding like two, three bundles of 30 inches. I know I'm gonna have hair left over, who cares? But yeah, like this hair is still long. Like I'm 5'8 and this hair still hits my butt. So no, cutting long, come long hair wear. Why? Just add to your long hair. I'm telling you, just add to it. It's nothing to get short bundles, y'all. It's nothing. That's like $120 on AliExpress. Or True Essence, like, look at their prices. It's like $45 per bundle, starting with the first bundle. Like, it's not nothing. But, you know, if you feel like... The only way I would cut my long bundles if it's, like, some really bad hair. If it's some bad hair, I'm going to cut it. Like, a long time ago when I had bought True Glory hair, I think it was the first video I ever made. I had bought, like, two 22s and a 20 and a um, I ain't get no closure. I want my rear hair out and the hair kept giving me problems so I ended up cutting it. It's my first video, you know, I'm sure you guys checked it out already if you haven't. But um, I dyed the hair and everything. It was just a mess. Do I still have the hair? No, I threw it away when I moved. Cause I was like, I'm not gonna put this, I'm never not gonna put this back in. It was a U part wig that I sold down. It was just too much. Until I got into these closure, boo. I had so down nothing else no more other than the tracks. But yeah, I don't want to make this video too long. Um, my final review on this hair, uh, with Uni's hair, I would not, well, you know what? I'm lying. I'm not lying to myself. I would not buy no more straight hair from them um, until they get their stuff together. <laughs> I give hair companies, you know, some time to just marinate, you know, they let them look at the reviews and try to get they, 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 they together because I'm not gonna say it's a waste of money, but shedding is not attractive. Sh it, it, hair is all in my dang on car. It's on my floor. It's on my dog. It's everywhere. It's not really attractive. It's not cute. Don't nobody want no shedding hair. So if I were to buy some straight hair, I would probably try another um, hair company on Alice Express. I'm pushing towards maybe like Ali Pearl or Ali Grace hair i've been looking at some wonderful reviews on that so i think i'm gonna purchase one of those and um add to this hair or just start over whatever the case might be but that's my final review on unique's hair we're not gonna hear about this hair no more you may see about it and i mentioned in the video what it is but yeah it's it's okay hair it's okay hair um i think it's like seven day hair hair that lasts for like a year or so a year probably so i'm not gonna really stress about it the hair did not cost me that much but it it cost me something you know it's not it wasn't free <laughs> so i am kind of being my feelings about it but i'm not even gonna trip about it because 
I already knew what I would get myself into when I purchased this from AliExpress. <clears throat> okay, you guys, thank you so much for watching. Um, thank you for being like OGs to my channel and being patient with me because like your girl going through a lot of it but um i really do appreciate you guys i gotta cover my bra up y'all y'all ain't supposed to know i had a bra on. <laughs> i really appreciate you guys being patient um subscribe to my channel if you like thumbs up to the video if you like the content of the video and i'm not gonna keep you guys waiting longer like that long for another video um so yeah i see you guys in the next video bye <laughs>